October is right around the corner, which means many of you will be coming to the area to take in the sights and sounds of fall in the mountains. This also means you'll need a place to stay in doing so. So in today's content, we're going to take a look at our favorite hotels in the Gateway to the Smokies, Gatlinburg, Tennessee. Before moving to the Smokies, and since starting our channel, we have stayed at dozens of hotels in the area. Obviously, there are many hotels we are yet to try, so this list will just contain our top picks from the lodging options we have experienced thus far. Our top 5 options in this video will include budget friendly options for you, as well as spots among the top of the pricing spectrum. The list will also be in no particular order, however, we will mention which of the selections we prefer over others and the reasons for such preferences. We will provide links to our full content of each hotel in the description of this video, so for more information on each, be sure to check there. Without further ado, we will bring you our top 5 hotels in Gatlinburg. This one will come to no one's surprise that regularly watches the channel. Riverhouse at the Park is uniquely located at the corner of River Road and Ski Mountain Road at the entrance of the Great Smoky Mountains National Park. This quiet riverfront site is within easy walking distance of restaurants and shopping areas on Gatlinburg's south side and offers easy access to the National Park both by car and the Gatlinburg Trail which begins right outside its front door. We have regularly stated that the River House is not only our favorite hotel in Gatlinburg but the entire Smoky Mountain area as well. The rooms are huge and always exceptionally clean. In all of our years of staying here we have never experienced a single housekeeping issue. This is their deluxe king room, which, like many of their rooms, is beautifully situated along the cliff branch of the Little Pigeon River and looks into the National Park. This family-operated hotel has some of the most friendly and helpful staff in the hospitality arena one can find. Oh, did we mention they fry their own donuts in-house every morning? Well, they do. What's more is they will bring them and other breakfast items right to your door every morning and come to scoop them up once you're finished. Sitting among one of the most affordable options in town, the River House sits at the top of our list for lodging options in Gatlinburg. Again, for more information about this hotel, be sure to check out the link in the description. Next on the list, the Appy Lodge. If you love a beautifully designed rustic mountain lodge, the Appy Lodge is for you. This Appalachian Trail themed hotel greets you as soon as you enter Gatlinburg from Pigeon Forge. Ownership of the Appy rests in the hands of a family which is among the first to settle in the area. Their goal of creating an immersive experience for those who may not have ambitions to hike the AT but still want to get a taste of that experience is evident. The rooms are named after points of interest along the famed trail. There are several displays throughout the hotel detailing facts and stories about the AT. Literally everywhere you look in the lodge, you are greeted with decor to remind you you are in the mountains. With indoor and outdoor pools, you can take a dip regardless of the time of year you visit. Our girls love the water features inside of the outdoor pool. Hiking has long been one of our favorite things to do. Personally, I have spent a great deal of time segment hiking the AT, so the theming here won me over immediately. We experienced friendly staff and clean rooms during our time at the Appy. One of the biggest surprises, especially after seeing the thought and effort of the design here, was the price. The Appy sits at the lower end of the pricing scale in town. For visitors who prefer walking access to downtown Gatlinburg, the lodge sits quite a distance from the city center. However, the hotel provides a voucher which gains its guests free access to a parking garage right on the strip, so they have you covered there as well. The Appy Lodge is a solid choice to be among the top spots to stay in town. Be sure to check the link in the description for more information. The Greystone Lodge on the River takes our next spot on the list. If it's location you're looking for in Gatlinburg, the Greystone Lodge has a beautiful location nestled between the Great Smoky Mountains National Park and the Little Pigeon River. It was almost as if the town as we know it today was built around the hotel, as the Greystone has been operating since 1962. Another family-owned hotel on the list, the Greystone offers friendly staff that understands what this area means to those who visit. The majority of our favorite shops, attractions, and other activities are all within walking distance from their location. Plus, all the Gatlinburg trolleys stop right outside the hotel. The outdoor pool and slide at the Greystone was a hit with the girls. Brittany's family have been guests here for decades, so this hotel has maintained service deserving of revisits. In busy season, Although a curvy and steep path, you can utilize Greystone Heights and Campbell Lead Roads to hit the Gatlinburg Bypass and miss a good portion of the incoming Gatlinburg traffic. Coming in at the middle of the pack in pricing, the Greystone won't break the bank. 
In conclusion, if you like being right in the middle of the hustle and bustle of Gatlinburg and within walking distance from nearly everything in town, the Greystone Lodge on the river is a perfect choice for your trip. Check out our full video in the description for more info. Next up is the Edgewater Hotel and Conference Center. Perched upon the banks of the Little Pigeon River and near the Great Smoky Mountain National Park, you will find one of the best hotels in downtown Gatlinburg. With a great downtown location, this eight-story high-rise offers amazing views of downtown Gatlinburg, the surrounding mountains, and the cliff branch of the Little Pigeon River. They also offer free parking and easy access to the Gatlinburg Trolley, so you can get to all the best attractions, restaurants, and shopping in the area without a hassle. One of the best amenities, in our opinion, at the Edgewater has to be the pool. This mountain-themed pool area serves as both indoor and outdoor pool areas in one. You can swim under the glass wall to access the indoor or outdoor portions of the pool. There is also a slide and two hot tubs to enjoy. The pool area alone is enough to rank this hotel among the best in the area in our book. We did find our room to be clean, however, this hotel does have an old town Gatlinburg feel. There is also some local lore here tied to this hotel, and you can find more about this in the link to our video in the description. With its location, amenities, and views, the Edgewater ranks among our favorite places to stay in Gatlinburg. Finally, last on the list is the Margaritaville Resort Gatlinburg, which is everything a mountain resort should be. This tropical brand of laid back luxury, well, luxury for Gatlinburg that is, will put you in the island state of mind while in a mountain setting. Kind of the best of both worlds. From the moment you enter this property, the grandeur of this accommodation is apparent. Valet will greet you as you pull up, ready to go above and beyond even if you don't elect to use their valet services. There is a spa on site. Rivers wrap around this property on three sides. The lobby is sprawling, bright, and beautiful, complete with birds ready for conversation. There's a bar and a restaurant. The back patio has a large flat screen, fire pit, and fireplace, and this pool. This pool area has no piers in Gatlinburg. It's simply better in just about every way than everyone else. A slide, tanning pools, water features, hot tub, indoor and outdoor, it has it all. As far as luxury is concerned in this town, this is where you'll find it. Margaritaville is consistent with this standard throughout. Arriving at your room, you can feel the grand theme continue. Everything is clean, fresh, bright, spacious, and extra. The views from the balcony are superb. This is likely one of the best bathrooms we've experienced anywhere, and this is taking into account actual luxury at resorts on both coasts at a much higher price point. I mean, check out this cool faucet in the tub. But speaking of price, this hotel sits at the very top of the spectrum. So while in almost every way, this hotel casts a shadow on almost all of its competition in the area, you will pay for it. Margaritaville Gatlinburg epitomizes the saying, you will get what you pay for. If you are looking to do the most with your lodging in Gatlinburg, there's no need to look any further. So this wraps up our list of the best places to stay in Gatlinburg. We hope we have provided some solid options for lodging for your next Smokies trip. Again, this is by no means a list considering all hotel options in town, rather a list comprised of places to stay that we have experienced ourselves. Please feel free to comment with your favorite place to stay in Gatlinburg in the comments below. Before we go, we do want to remind you that we are giving away 20 prints from G-Web Gallery for our 10K giveaway. If you haven't entered, there's still time to do so. Just go to the Retro Myrtle Beach Guy video linked in the description and comment the Smoky Mountain family sent me and subscribe while you are there. If we help the Retro Myrtle Beach Guy get to 1,000 subscribers before the drawing on Saturday, September 24th of 2022, we will add 10 more prints and therefore 10 more winners to the giveaway. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. If you made it this far, like if you liked it, comment if you're a fan, subscribe if you're feeling it. If not, that's okay too. Wow.